during the summer, I just worked on my perimeter game. You know, instead of playing inside the whole time, I I worked on you know playing out on the wing and you know trying to have an all-around game so I can do more on offense. Yeah, I have gotten physically stronger um, in my position, so I feel like I will be able to um, do what I need to do and be effective at it. The biggest adjustment for me as a freshman, um, just you know the the style of play and the level of play and the intensity that these guys bring. Um, they're definitely a lot faster, uh, run and gun type of team. Um, I think every college team is in high school. My coach likes to slow things down and go into half court, but these guys just like to play fast and use their athleticism. As a walk-on, my role this season is uh, to get my be my teammates better in practice, be there for them all the time, be early to practice, and work as hard as anyone else, and sometimes harder on and off the court. My biggest adjustment transferring from Redlands to UNCW has been the work schedule. Um, it's, a, it's more busy college basketball. You gotta lift weights, train, go to classes, and homework, study hall. It's, it's busy, so that's the biggest adjustment. Um, definitely, you know, being able to sit back, you know, kind of from the bench and see how the whole game works really was definitely big for me because I started out playing and I felt like I was kind of behind and the game was too fast for me. But after that, I got to get in the weight room and get stronger and faster. And, you know, being able to watch the game and understand it more definitely helped. Something I learned during my freshman year that would help me out this season is um, time management. Um, last year, you know, I was kind of lost for time, so this year I learned to be on top of things and stay on top of class. So this season, some of the things that people will see from Luke Hager are Maybe hopefully a little bit of everything. Um, I like to step outside, shoot the three a little bit, go to the rim strong, get rebounds, play good defense, and it's kind of what I pride myself on is doing a little bit of everything. I had always wanted to come out the uh, UNCW out of high school. Uh, fortunately, uh, I wasn't recruited by that many big, big D1 schools. So uh, now that I'm here, I'm very happy that I'm a part of this team. Since it's my senior year, the thing I want to accomplish most is um, a regular season championship and being able to look back on my four years here and know that I had a great time and I enjoyed myself and I made the right decision and um, that I love the guys in the locker room. I'm majoring in community health education and my future goals are to travel around the different communities and spread the word about health. Okay, well, I worked hard in the offseason and uh, just tried to get in better shape than I was last year, trying to uh, cut a few pounds but maintain the same weight, so kind of convert a little more muscle, fat to muscle. So I'm feeling better, feeling a little quicker, more explosive, and hopefully I can find the floor a little more this year. The biggest difference uh, this year compared to last year is probably going to be um, the chemistry that, that this team has. Uh, a lot of these guys, the upperclassmen at least, have been together for a couple years now, and having the, the freshman class that are now sophomores or the redshirt freshmen, you get to be around those guys for a year and, and you learn a lot more about each other. And on, on the court and off the court, you have a little bit better chemistry with one another. Oh, I continue to play because, you know, I just felt like UNC Women's Center is a great place. Um, it's two hours away from my hometown. To be able to play for a coach like Coach Peterson is also something I really wanted to do. It's also, I, I like my teammates and stuff like that, and I also like the role I feel to play on this team, so that's why. Being a Wilmington native is pretty cool. It's an opportunity I'm thankful to have. Um, something I'm hopefully used to from high school, but definitely excited about being able to do it. I had a tough end to the season last year with my ankle injury, but right now I'm feeling 100%. I've been 100% since the summer, so I'm really looking forward to this upcoming year, finally being able to play again, being back on the court with my teammates, and I'm excited.